Let's set the series of Zodiac High Let's go back to the 60s when they were on the Soviet Union. They're a big money maker for, for, for Russia. They're a big money maker for Russia. They have strength and ties. They have strength and ties historically, too. So, you know, it's not going to be easy for them to watch the ceasefire. I hope the ceasefire goes into effect. I hope it does. The ceasefire goes into effect. Which is significantly, significantly stops this bombardment of the you know, sectarian rebels. But the Islamic State still has to be bombed, still has to be taken care of. The Islamic State now in Kaida and Nursa still has to be taken care of. Those two are not part of the peace, peace to create peace accord. They gotta be guarded so they don't strike, try to falter the peace, try to falter the peace. Russian historic stereotypes going back to the 60s. Which is good for them. Which is good for them. Doesn't mean they want to prop up Bashar al Assad, since he's the only one there right now. <laughs> the agreement is, is when you get elections, they can elect a new leader. They can elect a new leader. So it's all started over protesting Bashar al Assad's nastiness, genocidal maniac ways. But he shouldn't be, shouldn't be, shouldn't be, shouldn't be president of this country. Looks like the peace accord's gonna work that way for a while. But hopefully, hopefully, they'll stop it. They'll stop it. They'll replace Bashar al Assad in the future. This is a big, big story to lose. Russian story ties go way back to the 60s. It's great. They have a close tie. But we'll see what's gonna happen. This is a big, big story to lose. Thank you.